Number 25, more than a toothache. Apparently, Patrick Lawler thought it was just his teeth, but imagine the dentist's surprise when he found a nail passing from the roof of his mouth all the way up into his brain. Number 24, epic fail marriage proposal. When an unnamed man from New Mexico planned on proposing marriage to his girlfriend, he hid the ring in her milkshake. Unfortunately for him, she must have been really thirsty that day, and his proposal was obviously delayed until the ring completed its journey. Number 23. A knife plunged through the head. When a trio of young men waiting on a bus tried to stop a robbery back in 2008, one of them ended up with more than he bargained for. He was completely coherent, though, and made a complete recovery. Number 22. Killed with a nail gun. Back in 2008 again, when investigators concluded that Chen Lu was in fact killed with a nail gun, no one argued with their findings. Number 21. A pair of scissors inside the abdomen. When Australian Pat Skinner came back to the hospital 18 months after surgery complaining of stomach pain, the doctors found something they'd lost over a year ago. Their surgical scissors. Number 20. An arrow inside the head. After a child in China was accidentally shot in the head with a bow and arrow, it pierced through his eye socket and went into the back of his skull. Despite the close call, he still somehow managed to survive. Number 19. Scissors for a toothpick. Apparently, someone in China borrowed a pair of scissors to clean their teeth after a meal and swallowed them by mistake when a friend told a joke and they laughed. Number 18. Burmese Python vs. the Electrical Blanket. This 12-foot Burmese python from Idaho needed surgery in order to remove the electric blanket and some entangled wires in its gut. Number 17. A soldier with nerves of steel. In spite of a knife penetrating 4 inches into his head just above his eyebrow, this soldier still somehow managed to survive the operation without any difficulties. Number 16. The knife-swallowing puppy. This 13-inch serrated knife blade somehow got lodged between the stomach and esophagus of a St. Bernard puppy in Florida for nearly four days before surgery was finally performed to remove it. Number 15. A light bulb from below. Is there an easy way to get a light bulb stuck in your large intestine? When doctors from Pakistan removed the light bulb from a prisoner, he had no explanation and seemed just as baffled as everyone else. Number 14. Cell phone and the colon. While the light bulb doesn't really make any sense, a cell phone, well, at least we could see a reason for this x-ray to exist. Taken in a prison in San Salvador, this shows just how much some people are willing to endure in order to stay connected. Number 13. A drill through the head. When construction worker Ron Hunt fell from a ladder while drilling on an elevated surface, his drill went ripping through his eye socket and out the back of his head. Amazingly enough, he survived. Number 12. Cobblestones in a love quarrel. For some reason, a girl in China swallowed over 20 cobblestones when she got upset with her boyfriend, thinking that eating and drinking would eventually flush them out. She was wrong. Number 11. Keys in the face. Although we're not sure how this could happen without child services getting involved, 17-month-old Nicholas Holderman somehow ended up with his mom's keys penetrating through his eye socket and into his skull. Fortunately, he made a full recovery. Number 10. A tap handle piercing the eyeball. 57-year-old Yi Zhao came into the emergency room one day holding up a piece of plumbing that was lodged into his skull via the tap handle. Apparently, he had slipped in his tub and landed in the worst way possible. Number 9. Huge kidney stone. Believe it or not, the 7-inch kidney stone was found in a patient in Hungary, and upon removal, it looked like a large, deformed ostrich egg. Number 8. Bed springs and batteries. As you may have noticed, some of the strangest x-ray findings happen to be in prisons. This one is no exception. Prisoners in Raleigh, North Carolina were found trying to smuggle batteries and bed springs in their stomachs. Call us crazy, but we're pretty sure that swallowing batteries is not a good idea. Number 7. Hold that live ammo. Although hemorrhoids can't be pushed anywhere because they're swollen veins in the lower rectum, someone apparently thought that they were losing their intestines and needed to shove them back up into their body using a bullet. The operation went well, and the bullet was removed, although at one point the bomb squad had to be called for fear that it would explode. Number 6. Forking a cockroach. Let's suppose that you somehow managed to nearly swallow a cockroach and it's stuck crawling away in the back of your throat. What do you do? You use a fork. At least that's what an Israeli woman chose to do with less than optimal results. Number 5. Attractive candy. When 8-year-old Haley Lentz found shiny metallic objects lying around the house, she naturally assumed them to be candy. 
Before long, her intestines were filled with magnets, and she had to be taken to the hospital keep, to keep them from clumping up inside her. Number four, sharp headache. It's amazing how many people have nails rammed straight through their skulls without knowing anything about it. The x-ray above belongs to a man in South Korea who showed up at the emergency room complaining of a headache only to get some surprising news. Number 3. The Head Grenade We're not exactly sure if this is even possible, but if so, this soldier was unlucky enough to find out how. Number 2. The x-ray of a suicide bomber Another hand grenade, this time in the stomach of a terrorist. Apparently he didn't think his plan through very well because he had no way of actually detonating the grenade once it was in his stomach. And number 1. The Chair Leg Shafiq El Fakri learned the hard way not to get in fights in the land down under when 20-year-old Liam Pearl hurled a chair in his direction. The result? One leg of the chair pierced through his eye socket and went all the way down through his neck.